up y'all? I'm Intricately Random Asian or Ira for short. Thank you very much for clicking on this random video that you haven't stumbled upon on YouTube. If you've been here for a while, welcome to another load of randomness but with a purpose. Buckle up your seatbelts and enjoy the ride. As you can tell from the title, this video is going to be a special 1K edition video. So I want to share the very special and awesome news that I hit 1,000 subscribers last Sunday, July 26th. And it also means that it's a milestone for me to be able to start monetizing videos, which I was able to do the day right after, which was really quick, surprisingly. So that's two great newses in one announcement. So before I dive into my thanks and directly talk to you guys, my viewers, um, I just want to give a little backstory on how I got here in the first place. So I restarted doing videos and relaunched my channel in May when lockdown started getting into my head. And I made a relaunching video where I explained pretty much like my YouTube history and all that. I've always loved making reaction videos. I was making reaction videos mostly on K-pop songs back then. And I thought that when I was going to relaunch my channel, you know, I'd be talking about some random stuff like vlogging, language learning, ranting, giving advice, and you know, other things like that. And also sprinkle in some reaction videos here and there of K-pop. But my channel took a really interesting and unexpected turn when my good friend Didi, I know most of y'all have heard of him, I shouted him out a lot in my previous videos. And for a good reason, because he's actually the reason why I'm here now. It all started when Didi requested me to watch Little Big's Uno, and that was the ball that pretty much started everything. And well, here I am now, 29 videos later, talking to you guys. You know, when I think about it, like who would have known that I'd end up niching mostly in this area for now? I had never thought that I would be making reaction videos to European music, especially Russian music. It's something that's, you know, it, it was super unexpected. And I would have never imagined that my horizons in music would have opened up because of this one video that I decided to do for my friend. And also, you know, when I really think about it, if the pandemic never happened, then I would have never started YouTube again. I would have never been sitting here in front of you guys, in front of my Canon M50 camera instead of my phone, <laughs> making fun content. Well, at least I guess I think you guys think my content is sort of fun. Um, and yeah, so I would have never gotten here because I would have been busy working in the Czech Republic because I was supposed to move there this July. But you know, that happened and stuff. And I would have never met all these really cool people on my channel who have been here since the beginning, you know, when I started off with 116 subs. So speaking of subscribers, I want to say a huge, huge thank you from the bottom of my heart for taking the time to sit down. You know, you take time out of your day to sit down, watch my random stuff and comment and like, like your time is important and I want you to value your time. So when I see that you actually watch my videos, it means a lot. So I want to say a huge thank you. Bolshoye, spasiba, merci, salamat, kamsham nida, shishe, gracias, grazi, dekui, dankeschön, arigato gozaimasu to all my viewers and subscribers. And I think that's all the languages that I know how to say thank you in for now. And although, like, according to my YouTube analytics, although 65% of my viewers are Russians, I also have a lot of other countries who are watching my stuff. I was like whoa okay i never thought that i would be reaching all of these countries you know so first on the list obviously we have russia and then ukraine the us belarus and germany so thank you very much everyone who took the time to watch my stuff as of now and you know hopefully you'll stick around as my channel grows some more and because i value you guys a lot because you know you're actual human beings well i mean i hope for the most part that you're actual human beings <laughs> You never know. You probably noticed that I take the time to comment on every single one of your comments. In all of my videos, I make sure to respond at least within the first four days. And I do not get notifications when, for example, you leave a comment and then I reply and then you reply back. I don't get any notifications whatsoever from YouTube. So I actually have to go like manually into each video and check in each comment if I got any replies from my replies. And I really wanna, you know, keep this momentum and commenting back. I just find it super important to interact with the people who are the reason why you got to where you're at in the first place. And also cause I just enjoy talking to you guys, you know, getting to know y'all and stuff. And by the way, interestingly enough, my stats show me that 
My viewers are predominantly male, standing at 84% and aged between 25 to 34 years old. Like, okay, cool, I guess, but where are the ladies at? <laughs> you know, like, you women can watch me too, you know? But anyway, so I was saying that you guys are very important to me and I like interacting with you guys, it's pretty fun. And y'all are really nice for the most part. I mean, I've only gotten like about eight hate comments or mean comments thus far and I really find it funny, you know? I think I'll just make a separate video where I react to you guys' mean comments when I do get more, you know? Because, I mean, this is the internet after all. There's a lot of people out there. There's all kinds of people out there and you get all sorts of comments sometimes, okay? So anyway, to really show my appreciation for you guys, I've made an extensive list. Okay. Of the people who have been here since the beginning and for the new people who've been here consistently and who I've seen who commented on like three videos or more. So I went back to all my 29 videos and I checked all the comments. All of the comments. There were a lot of comments, okay? <laughs> okay, I don't have like millions, but I had at least, you know, a good hundred in each video. Legit, it took me two hours to go through each comment and to write down the names of the people who interact regularly and who show up in the comment section pretty much like in every video. So at first I thought it was only gonna be around like 40 people, Fight. but then it ended up being 138. So, <laughs> I'm gonna shout y'all out individually. All your names are, you know, like Russian, Ukrainian, and stuff like that, so I will definitely mispronounce your names. It's not because I want to, it's because <laughs> I'm not familiar with Russian pronunciation yet. So I'm really sorry if I do butcher your name, but I'll try my best, I promise. So I have 138 people to shout out. There's really no particular order in how I wrote your names. I'll show you. I mean, you have regular names right there, right? Okay, there you go, regular names. You have some on the side, like over there, and same on the other side. And I'm sure that I missed a couple of people, so if I did miss you, just please manifest yourself down in the comment section of this video. Be like, yo, Ira, you forgot about me. But I'm pretty sure I have everyone down here. But yeah, like I said, if I forgot you, please let me know. <laughs> And I apologize in advance. All right, so I would like to give a special shout out to, of course, Didi. Didi, I love you. I can't wait to see you again in Europe whenever I get to Europe. <laughs> By the way, I pretty much Google translated all of your names because most of your names were like in Russian and I don't read Russian yet. So yeah, I really hope it's accurate. But anyway, so yeah. Didi, Toxigenic, Maxim Barkin, Yuri Fury, Esu, Jidu, Andreas Faust, Andrei Larin, XN Tyler, Julia Bal, H E Z, <laughs> Hezi, Leonid Shevchenko, Diki Krot, Alex Jade, Ruslan Smith, Rad Commander, Artifactor, Ilya, also known as. People are always asking me if I know Tyler Durden. Paul, just Paul. Sergey Romanov, User No, Game Over. Man, I should have written this more clearly. <laughs> Raman Sevryugin, John Doe, Nakhmed, Misanthropy Ferret, Gordon Freeman, MIT, all in caps, Vladimir Matskevich, so sorry man, Roman Mikhailov, Pavel Yah, Linerges, Zijan Mia, Nick Vim, George Pechatna, Pavel Borisov, Nikita Chaikin, Igor Kuzmenko, Valerie Z, Chaz Ivaniv, Ilya Chumakov, Alexander Chumovsky, Mindjam, aka Artyom, who by the way has started his own reacting channel now. I'm going to leave a link to his channel down in my description bar. Pravover, Yaroslav Dmitriev, Zeus Weightlessness. <laughs> That's what Google Translate said, okay? Kaskil Nikolaev, Cool Off, Lil Rain, Ivy Ivy, Vladimir Lepekhin, uh, again, I'm really sorry, Andreas Anderson, Los Duru, <laughs> Antonio Tejada, or Tejada, Stas Kiselev, I, I really hope I copied them right, because. Man, I, I feel really sorry if I did not write them properly. Igor Ejikov, Artyom, Don Juan Matus, and Merrick BXL. And then down here we have Roman Suprik, Nina Sorokina, Ocean Foam, and Pavel Frank. 
page 2. Alexei R, Parapano, Oleg Sidorenko, Darth Goha, C4, Murad Borz95, Von Luxemburg, Madtrix, Vladimir Voropiev, Lutra Lutra33, Justin McNamara, Vyacheslav, Vasily Gavrish, Daus Boris, Anton Antonov, Sergei Chachenko, Anthony Kalinin, Funky God, Fury1983, Inuales Siri, a seer. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Randall Lewis, Bistimian Bukin, Drawn, Panulni, Peninsula, Armorer 100, Angel Drahiski, D for D, Skachkova, Violet, Yuri Zima, Akato, Vladimir Kravchuk, Toby, Kotrijik, FBR5, Larry Leont, Alric Guest, Peopo Nani Rio, Dragon Pavloi, Mutul Bakaev, Sophie Timofeeva, who's working really hard, by the way, to put Russian subtitles in my video, so thank you very much, Sophie, for that. I appreciate it greatly. Konstantin Alexiev, Dorothy Death 666, Alex Week, Molly McGee, Vitali Romaniok, Soliman De Nazir, Fun Funny, All in Caps, Tiarhe Varantsu, Latozi 1987, Vitali Pashkov, Vasily Gavrish, Alexei Terekhov. There's a lot of Alexeis and Romans and Vlad's too. Dronov Mikhail. Didn't I say you already? Anyway, if I say you twice, good for you, I guess. Okay, Igor, there's a lot of Igors too. Igor Kasatkin, P5U1K, Sergei Semenko, Student Russian, Ivan Petrov, Russian grad, Vyuchev, Iron Razma 25, IE0AP, Azot, Timur Pronin, Slava, Clem, Hell, I can't even read myself. Bruh. Slava Klemyat, IT Recruitment EU, Sergei Zavialov, H I B W B M, all in caps, Gideon Tech, Dinara Kim, and best for last, I did not forget you, okay, is Consti Belos. He's my viewer who had the really great idea and awesome creativity to start making memes out of me. <laughs> from my videos. So I'm going to share with you some of his best work. They're pretty awesome. And I mean, this inspired me to probably like make this competition slash challenge thing with you guys. If you want to do it, then pitch in. It'd be really fun. Is that y'all could make memes out of my face and then send it to me on Instagram. And then I'll choose the best one of that week or of that video. And I'll present them at the beginning of my reactions. That'd be so fun if you guys do it. Okay, so anyway, Consti's memes. <laughs> So he started off with this one. It was from my cabriolet reaction. <laughs> At first I didn't get it, but then it was just like Vlad Putin watching my video. <laughs> and then we have this from In Peter We Drink. And then this one again. <laughs> Man, I, I didn't know my face was that traumatizing. Thanks, Consti. And this one. Oh, and this one's probably my favorite. But PewDiePie, <laughs> this one too, <laughs> and this one too. <laughs> oh, I've officially become the shining <laughs> Asian version. <laughs> and then this one, where it says, when you're a freshman and trying to find the right audience in a confusing university building. And then the next one, when you're a sophomore and you show a stupid freshman the wrong direction. <laughs> And then the love. I think this was from Lollibomb. Yeah. And then we got Luke Skywalker being like, no. <laughs> oh man. And here's Darth Vader and Luke Skywalker again. And then this one again. <laughs> from the love. You know what I'm saying? Oh my gosh, I swear. And then I asked him like, yo, Consti, where the heck do you find these ideas? And he's just like, I don't know inspiration <laughs> you freaking creative monster and then oh my god I'm loving it <laughs> so sexualized and of course you can't plug I'm loving it without plugging it into McDonald's obviously oh my god and this one the Miyagi reaction when you show the Japanese <laughs> Bruh. can't even read anymore <laughs> when you show how the Japanese Bluetooth bro And then the Japanese after Hiroshima. <laughs> oh, it's very consty. 
You're so special. Oh, and this one from the AK-47. When you meet your ex on the street. And then the next one. <laughs> when you meet your next on the street. <laughs> like what, my next mistake? <laughs> oh my god, I swear. Oh, and this one from the Nileto reaction. Consti says, intro rip. Because <laughs> I skipped my intro. <laughs> I was way too excited about watching Nileto. And then here, this is me trying to look cheerful. <laughs> and sociable in the morning. I do look like that every morning though. <laughs> so there's no difference when it comes to me. Yeah, that's pretty much it for now. So if you guys want to start making memes as well, like I said, it'd be really fun if you do. Just send them on my Instagram. I always put my Instagram down in my description. So yeah, just DM me, man. Like, yo, here's a meme I made of you. And by the way, it'd be really fun if y'all tell me your real names because most of y'all, or at least a good portion of y'all, have a username that is not like a real name so it'd be really nice if i knew your real name so that i could thank you properly yeah just putting that out there but you know if you want to i mean you say your real name but yeah so that's cons tea for you and obviously since most of my viewers are from russia and all you know people have been saying like oh so when are you gonna learn russian when are you gonna start learning russian and i was like y'all don't worry because look at what i got <laughs> Hey, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? All right. So basically I got this book after work one time and I had a gift card to the store called Indigo and I was saving it, you know? A friend of mine had given it to me for my birthday last year and I was like, okay, I'm gonna use it to buy like the Lord of the Rings Silmarillion, you know? But then I never bought that book and I was like, okay, I'm gonna save it to buy more German learning books and that never happened and so I kept saving it and then this happened. So I knew there was a really good reason why I was saving that gift card. It was because of this, you know, destiny. Oh, and by the way, speaking of destiny, it's so funny how like my past just bites me in the butt <laughs> after a while. Cause like when I first came to Canada, I remember my first crushes. I was like in grade three, okay, or grade two even. I was, anyway, I was like eight years old. And I remember my two crushes one was named Nikolai and the other one Pavlo. Nikolai was from Bulgaria and Pavlo from the Ukraine. And I was like, damn, this is so funny that, you know, I have Bulgarian viewers and Ukrainian viewers and now I'm like gonna start learning Russian too. And you know, <laughs> all of this. And also I have this one friend. I know that she started learning Russian back then. And I was like, dude, why are you learning Russian? It's like, you're never gonna use it. And she was like, it's just a really beautiful and interesting language, you know, and it's a challenging one. So I wanna try and learn it. And I was like, oh, okay, yeah, good point. And one time when I was in university, they were giving away like these free books and I saw some Russian grammar books. And I was like, hmm, should I get it? Should I not? And I was thinking of getting those books for her in the first place. But then I was like, eh, you know what? screw that and then looking back at that to where I am now I was like I should have freaking taken those Russian books damn it anyway that's history so yeah I really look forward to having my first Russian lessons at least I hope that I can learn the Cyrillic is that what you call it the the alphabet so that I could at least read a few of your comments without Google translating them you know oh and speaking of the comments like <laughs> Like, you guys are mostly nice in the comment section, but like, I read all your comments, right? And I see that people are having beef, like, fighting over something, and I'm just like, <laughs> eating popcorn, sipping iced tea, and I'm like, hmm, should I tell them to like, stop fighting, or should I just let them blabber on about whatever they have to blabber about? And I was just like, ah! just opt for option two because this is the internet people say whatever they want and so yeah anyway wish me luck with my future russian learning you know that you can look forward to videos of me failing at learning russian <laughs> I need your help guys, okay? It's really hard. I have to make videos of me learning German as well and skateboarding and stuff. But yeah, like I said, obviously I'm going to be making more reaction videos, you know, cause that's what my main niche is as of now. And yeah, I just really hope that you guys will stick around as my channel grows some more. And again, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all your support and all your help. I mean, like all I did is make videos and you guys did the rest, you know? It's like a teamwork on 
on your end because it's you guys who subscribed and commented and liked my stuff. So it's all thanks to you if I got here. So take all the credit, it's yours. I mean, it's kind of like your channel now too, as much as mine in a sense. So yeah, thank you very much again. And I think I'm just going to end this here because or else I could go on for 10 more hours. All right, so thank you very much everyone for sticking to the end of this video if you made it this far. And thank you also if you clicked halfway through or anything. And like I said, if I missed you in the shout outs or if I said your name wrong, and stuff which i'm pretty sure i did let me know anyway okay <laughs> and yeah thank you guys so thank you all for watching i hope you liked it don't forget to comment like share subscribe if you want to and as usual get out there and be random because randomness is a lifestyle so get on board with me and let's embrace it i'll see y'all in my next video bye